Agekho ozosvimba ngisho nawe imbala Ayivive You know Shaka you don't have to be so rude when declaring war okay you don't roll your eyes at me if you're going to look at me yes thank you hello there I am going to liberate every single one of these skulls all these skulls in here will be mine and I will bury them because that's where they belong in the ground rude you will pay for this in time you filthy warmonger. Alright, this is actually really, really cool. Because now we can actually get this going underway almost immediately, really. And I think I might move this guy out of the city. Oh, maybe not. There's some triremes. Uh, hmm. Well, actually, yeah, move out there. Attack him. And you attack him because attacking boats on water is so much better than attacking them on land. <laughs> Definitely. Good. All right. Shaka has declared. Yes, I don't mind. Fortify. You are going to fortify as well. All right. Come out this way, please. Oh, look at that. More ruins. Oh, that's fantastic. Yeah, sit right there. We'll grab that and uh, heal up. All right, everybody. Fortifications. We cannot let them through. Getting some interesting music for Shaka's war theme. <laughs> Aye! All right. Battling Shaka Zulu. Or Shaka of the Zulu. But it's fine, Shaka is going to die if I can't help it. All right, explore that little island, good. And then we'll head uh, basically over this way. Yep, keep killing this. I don't like it there. All right, uh, yeah, kill the boats, and then work on them. Good. Get rid of those archers. In fact, attack them once, just to show that we're not backing down from this area. We have 10% bonus against hills, so that's just fantastic no matter what. Uh, plus, I want to gain experience on him and make him rough terrain. That way there, he's really, really good against hills. Uh, you know, attacking on hills in rough terrain. I just think that's... Oh, it's a great natural wonder. <laughs> I can't stress it enough. And the fact that this is here, I can't stress that enough either. I mean... I, I just... This is a fantastic game. I really do enjoy it right now. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Let us plant the seeds of a bright future with Arabia. We're working together. Good. Oh, religion founded. Confucianism in the Zulu lands. Oh, no. Get your heinous religion off this island. It's going to be mine. Sol Invictus will conquer everything. Okay, I should clarify. Confucianism, I don't have anything against it in real life. I said that because it's a game. People take this way too much out of context, and I'm just going to clear this up right now. Any religion that I've ever said anything bad about in this game was strictly for the purposes of this game. It does not relate to anything in real life. And I'm saying that because I've had some issues in the past with people saying that I mean what I say, and that's not true at all. It's a game. Please, respect that it doesn't mean anything. All right, let's take out these, uh, these bowmen over here. Get out of here. You don't belong. All right, where are you going to go next? I guess, yeah, work on a farm right there. And we'll swing around this way. Hopefully we'll find another civilization soon. Yeah, just sit tight. Actually, no, not don't heal. Fortify. Thank you. Oh, stop it. 
Yes, I think so. Gold. Yep, absolutely. I am getting worried, though, about this flank right here, because they are coming down here. Um, my workers are now vulnerable. Right, yes, I want you to build a farm. Thank you very much. Oh, we have um, a trium down here as well. Should I bring it back? I mean, we already are bringing it back. Yeah, let's send it up here. Let's go. We're bringing this into the battle. And as for you... Well, there is a lot of rough terrain up here. I mean, yes, where we're going to be battling right now is not. But there is a lot of rough terrain up here, and I want to use him up here. So, grab that. Kill him. And you know what? You can just heal. Actually, go into the city and then heal, because I want to make sure that we can defend against whatever's coming up from down here. Wipe them out. And then sit right there. Get him! Yeah, good job. Okay, so now that we have that, and we're fully healed, I want you to swing your bum down here to grab that ruin, and then over there. Thank you. So, we were right there, and we went ding, ding, ding. So, I'm not sure exactly if that does much in the way of um, helping out a scout. What's going on? Oh, they want um, gold gifts to them. Okay, well, I'll definitely do that. Because that's not much at all, and plus, now we're allies. Psh. Allies, hello. That's only for three turns, but uh, it it'll be fine. Oh, Hanoi, another militaristic city state. This is insane. We have so many near us. Um, yeah, come on down this way. Uh, yeah, just wait. <laughs> oh, that was so cute. Are you kidding? Guys, guys, do you- <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, that's fantastic. I love it. I really do. <laughs> oh, good job, Almady. Wow. I, I love when they try to attack me from the water. It's just, it's a complete failure. It really is. All right, we have a caravan back. Let's go in here and see what's uh, the best route besides all of the lovely little, um, cargo ships is Kyoto to Almaty. All right, well, we'll do that, definitely. We're also working on our other caravan in three turns. That'll definitely help us out. Oh, my. They have some issues with barbarians, it looks like. Yeah, over there. Hmm. Oh, well, not my problem. Yes, rough terrain, absolutely, like I said. Oh, my God. This guy is fantastic. Um... I guess we'll just wait until next turn to see what they do. So just, uh, just heal for a turn, I guess. Yeah. And we're sending you on up to hopefully... I don't know. I mean, we can't really siege out with you. You're not... You won't do that much damage to... Well, actually, you did do a... A little bit of damage to a city. So, yeah, we'll, we'll use you, I guess. Um, yeah, but if you look right here, right? It says... You will receive extreme liberation bonus that erases previous warmonger penalties if you liberate this city. That is fantastic. So I definitely want to take out these three cities up here before I do that. It's just, it's a no-brainer. It's a nice, easy defense. Let's see, do we push them back? Uh, n no, that's land. I think so. Well, now we're in fourth, so I don't know. Come on, you might as well just... No? You're not going to sacrifice yourself? Alright. Suit yourself. <laughs> oh, boy. The world's most wonderful people. Yes, I am in last, but... Better is bread with a happy heart than wealth with vexation. Yes, we have currency, but what I was going to say was that in one turn, we're going to get one good, glorious world wonder. That's just fantastic. Oh! Cerro de Patanas. There are so many natural wonders right now. This is insane. And more ruins. That's just awesome. More? Are you kidding me? Oh my goodness.
My scout is going to have a field day. <laughs> uh, yes, we will give you rough terrain as well. And make sure he does not make it on land. Well, he made it, but at least he's damaged, if that makes any consolation. It doesn't, but we get more experience no matter what, so. Uh, yeah, you know what? You might as well just fortify right there again. I think that if ever a mortal heard the word of God, it would be in a garden at the cool of the day. Awesome. All right, we have the Hanging Gardens, which gives us six, um, food. <laughs> Hang on, I gotta look. Six food and one culture. That's awesome. And a free garden. That is really, really good. It is. Um, so after all that, give me a writer's guild, please. All right. Uh, I'm not sure. I really want to have catapults before I have anything else because we can basically go in now um, but we just need more ranged units I don't think that the Kaposma one will really cut it for uh... yeah no I think we're gonna need catapults absolutely well I think we can move up at least one more that way there we can expand our uh, basically our sphere of influence I don't know if that's the right sentence you use there but it does make a little bit of sense Oh, and the Arctic. Okay, so I'm going to start heading back up this way and head around this little uh, peninsula. Okay, swing up this way now. Valletta calls for faith. I'm not sure if I'm able to do that, uh, but I, I could definitely try. Okay, so we have that from Osaka. Good. I think that's the only one we can really do, so just go there. Thank you. Yes, uh, you can reach a little bit farther away now, which is awesome. So, sit there. And... Uh, yeah, just sit back here now. Yes, and of course, we did lose Almaty, but that's okay. I wasn't expecting to keep them as an ally for that long. Um, so hopefully before that, uh, that gold thing goes away, we'll get another one. Hopefully 500, actually. I'd be much, much better to pay 500 and gain, like... What is it? Hello? 65. Yeah, that's a lot. Alright, you're coming up this way now. We're gonna have basically like two identical sides here. That's the only issue with the mountains is that they're very, very good for defense. But trying to attack as well is kind of hard. Almighty wants Sol Invictus. Well, actually, you're gonna get it rather soon. Because it's already spreading to you. So, very, very shortly. Don't worry. Yes, just, uh... I wish I could fortify boats. It doesn't really make much sense, but I... I well, I can sleep with them. Yeah, no, I don't. Just go there and s alert. All right. Uh, cow, cow. Oh, they have another one. Another great general. Damn it. So now they have two. Pompey and cow, cow. Okay. Sit there, please, with the, uh, the Kapas Bowman, and you'll be good. Statue of Zeus has been built in a faraway land. Well, at least it's not Shaka Zulu. All right, keep coming up this way. What was that? I don't even understand. Why couldn't... <laughs> Alright, fine. Be that way. Alright, so let's take a look here. Uh, oh, well, wait, actually. We gotta wait for this to happen. Alright, they're dead. Well, hopefully next turn. I wanted to go in here and take a look at what, uh, where we can settle. So what's going to grab all these tiles and be an overall good city to settle? So I think right in the middle here will be good. Yeah, that's, it's recommending that. However, that's a jungle. And I don't want to get rid of jungles. So if we settle down here, we could get... The iron, obviously we can get one, two, three. We can get that fish. We can encompass the whole island, essentially. That whale. All atolls. That fish down... Yeah, right there. That is happening. Oh my goodness. That's a perfect city location. Oh, I'm excited to settle there. I really am. Okay, yeah, you're coming back this way. And we have a wall now in uh, Tokyo. Well, next turn. Oh, no, Ulundi has walls. Crap, that's going to make it a little bit harder. I don't know. We'll see. We will see. I'm wondering if they would take a peace deal. No. 
Okay. I, I'm not. I don't want a peace deal. Trust me. But uh, it will be interesting to see what they would offer me. Really? Really? <laughs> Do not wait to strike till the iron is hot, but make it hot by striking. Yes, iron working. Thank you. Which unlocks the Colossus, but I think that was built, wasn't it? Or no, maybe I think I'm the Great Lighthouse, yeah. Um, yeah, I can't believe they just attacked me. <laughs> That's hilarious. Alright, come down here and attack this guy. Good. And you are going there to build us some more farms. Because Tokyo needs to grow. We can also work on a new technology, right. I think we should rush into guilds at this point. So we can start working on trading posts. Uh, artist guild, that'd be great. Yeah, let's do that. Guilds and then horseback riding and then we'll go from there. Alright, Tokyo. Build me a library, please. And then a shrine. Where do I stand in soldiers now? So three still. But Shaka's not in first. So that's good. We knocked him down at least. All right, let's see. Come down this way. And wipe him out once and for all. And we get an experience, or uh, a level, which is good. Very, very good. All right. Oh, we got catapults. Almady. Oh my god, I love you so much. I really do. Well, in actually one more turn, I can give you my $500 gift. However, I'm going to wait a little bit longer. In fact... If they get Sol Invictus, that'll push it up even farther. So I'm not really worried about it. That's just fantastic. And actually, after another seven turns, we'll have one more. So that's just good. That is just really, really good. This seems to be going my way. I love it so much. I don't want to over-speak, but I I'm really, really enjoying this right now. Chichen Itza was built in a faraway land. Yes, as long as it's not Shaka, I'm happy. Cape Town seeks a great writer. Yes. Uh, well, after I build the majority of the army in here, I'm going to work on a uh, writer's guilds. Oh, I'm already doing that. How did I forget that? Right. Don't mind me. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. Uh, yeah, boarding party, please. And you know what? You should probably head back. Well, I don't know. Go a little bit farther. Oh! Genghis, I wasn't expecting to see you there, but I'm glad I went the extra distance to, to meet you. That's awesome. Where are you? Uh, you are right over here. Oh, lovely. Well, that's good to know. I'm going to send my trireme back to um, Osaka, and then we'll send him back out to explore the capital. If that is a way over. I'm not sure, though. We might have to go up and around. Oh, our scout's actually almost down here, surprisingly. Let's take a look. What do we get? And... No! I don't want a map! Dang it! Dang it! <laughs> uh, we have uh, a couple more to, to discover before anything else, so... It's not that bad. Oh, boy. It had to have been a map, right? Just had to be. Yeah, build me a mine, please. Oh, and another fishing boat. Right, go over there. Because this side needs more love. <laughs> there we go. One on each side so far, so that's two culture. Hello, I'm trying to do something. Goodness me. Yeah, two culture so far in this city that's being extraly worked. Because that's, that's something people say. Lovely. That is just fantastic. And we have Satsuma. Lighthouse. Because that's more production. And I'll work on getting you a worker eventually. I, I think I might actually buy one a little bit later. Uh, I don't know. Do I want to give money to Almady? Or buy a... You know what? Just buy a worker. Yeah, because we really need that iron right now. That's, that's the most of what we need. So purchase... Worker. There we go. It's going to take, I believe... Oh, um, how much do you have? Oh, you don't really have much, do you? 
Yeah, no, sorry. It's not worth it. I will take open borders, though. Oh! Oh, you're gonna be greedy like this, aren't you? Yeah, okay. No, sorry. I can't negotiate with people that don't accept a simple trade deal as open borders with me. Sorry. Maybe later. Okay, yep, come up here, and we'll be able to see how much it's gonna take next turn. For now, though, we're gonna go over here to the other ruins with this scout, and hopefully it's an archer. Give me an archer. That would really, really help me out at this point. Oh, we're unhappy. Oh my goodness, hang on. I need to trade with somebody. I, did, I totally just blanked out. Um, I saw it for a second, and then I just totally forgot about it. Right, uh, Arabia. You have some pearls, and I have some gems. Let's get trading. Thank you. Mongolia does not have anything, and Shaka is at war, so we can't really do much there. Oh, 13 turns. Lovely. We need to build a coliseum. So, after that workboat, build me a glorious coliseum, please. Thank you. Oh, you can build the coliseum. I... Oh... That's really worth it. Do it. Well, after the... the no. After the catapult. That's, that's incredibly worth it to grab that. Only 11 turns. Wow. In fact, grabbing the oracle in Osaka is also worth it, too. <laughs> but the oracle's been around for a while, so I'm not... Okay, there's the Colossus. Crap! We had a glorious opportunity there. Well, regardless, we have another, um... Catapult, and again, rough terrain, so rough terrain. And come up there, please. Well, I guess we'll go ahead and work on the Oracle then. Push that to the front, because I know Almady wants it. Uh, probably somebody else does too, so we'll definitely grab that. There we go, the first catapults have arrived. Oh, barbarian encampments. Are you kidding me? I don't care. Uh. Oh, we have two more. Stop giving me useless crap. <laughs> oh, the two worst things to get out of a ruin. And I got both of them. Wow. I, I really don't like those. <laughs> I mean, the map is very helpful if you're exploring with the scout. But I'm not. I already explored this area. It was pretty much pointless to grab that. Alright. Grab that. Let's go. Uh, this side. Right, and we have this, so set up for a little bit until we're ready, and then we'll go in eventually. Attack! <laughs> Dang, Chirim. That might actually cause some damage, I'm not sure. And I guess over here we'll build another farm. Yeah, it works. Come on. Come on! There we go. I don't know why you have to shake the screen. It's kind of weird. Well, I mean, this is like the most peaceful war that we've had with, with Shaka at this point. Because the only thing that's really fighting at this point is uh, the triremes. Yeah, it's kind of funny. Like, they see our units and they're like, you know what? Let's just not even bother going over there. <laughs> Alright, keep killing him. Now, he's unhappy as well. I just saw that. It said he was unhappy, so that's a very, very good sign. A very, very good sign. Well, after this shrine, I'm going to work on another coliseum in Tokyo. And uh, after all of this stuff that's in Kyoto right now, I'm going to work on a Colosseum as well, and then hopefully uh, we can build a Circus Maximus within reason. I mean, Satsuma needs to build it too, but hopefully... I don't know, hopefully it gets some production soon. It does have some, uh, some hills, and then we have the forest to work. The merchants and the traders have come. Their profits are preordained. Right, yes, okay, we have guilds. Awesome, so that unlocks the East India Company. Machu Picchu, which we may or may not be able to build, depending on if Tokyo can or not. The Artist Guild, Trading Posts, and Enable Wealth Production. This life of man appears for a short space, but of what went before, or what is to follow, we are utterly ignorant. Right, yes, okay, so now we're in the medieval era. I love it. Yeah, we have the Artist Guild. I don't think I'm going to build it in this city. Market, Colosseum, yeah, Colosseum after that. All of that. Good. Alright, this guy's coming over here. Last and final catapults for the time being. Where are you trading? All the way with Almady? Really? Well... We will definitely cut that off. 
absolutely. Uh, that's not happening. It's an extra 200 gold, too, if I... Or, actually, I don't know. I think it depends on era. Alright, why don't you sit right there, destroy him, and uh, we should be able to destroy that cargo ship as it comes through. Lovely. Oh, there it is. We'll take it out this turn, that'd be good. Fantastic. That really is nice. Nice, easy money, right off the bat. <laughs> Pyramids were built. Alright, that's fine. Alright, take him out. How much? Oh, it is 200, no matter what. Alright, fantastic then. Then I want you to go over here to Kyoto and just uh, heal up. Actually, you know what? Setsuma. I think that's a little bit quicker, right? Two, two, well, it doesn't really matter. Alright, sit there. Set up for ranged. And I think we're ready to go in to Shaka's Land when we come back next time. I hope you all enjoyed. Thanks for watching. And definitely stay tuned for more.